It's worth noting that Commercial Bank of Kuwait is not just one of the largest financial institutions in Kuwait, it's also one of the longest established. What are its origins? The bank was established as number two bank in June 1960, and it has to be approved by the Amiri decree. Um, so it's a Kuwaiti bank, of course, and it was established by business people uh, from the local market. And that was the date when it was born as a bank. So technology and innovation have consistently played a part in the bank's development since then? Uh, we can say that Commercial Bank of Kuwait was one of the first banks it's number one that implemented the ATM machines in the country. And in 1973, they have uh, participated or got into the innovation of technology that helped the bank to go forward. And still we are going into that same line and we just recently finalized the main core banking system has been replaced by the old one. A new one is in place now that we have been working on. What are the main pillars of the bank's business now? The two most important pillars of the bank, and you can say traditionally it has been across the years, it's the retail banking and the corporate business, because they are main, the butter and bread of the business in Kuwait, in the banking industry in general. Corporate lending by its name, you are lending to the corporate side for different types of companies, um, dealing in the trading, investments, real estate, uh, activities related to the corporate in general. It can be small, middle-sized enterprises and large enterprises. Through the retail banking, we have 52 branches. So you have one of the largest, it's not the largest, but one of the largest branch network in the country. So it helps you to integrate within the society, to provide your products and services. So within Q8, it's quite a diversified bank. It is, in addition to what I have mentioned, like retail and corporate, you have also international business, you have treasury activities, investments, which used to be, of course, an important pillar in the business before the crisis takes place worldwide and later on affected the Middle East and the GCC, of course. Which areas of the bank's business are particularly important for the development of Kuwait's economy? Presently, corporate banking is a very important pillar for the growth of the bank and in the country in general. You have heard probably about the development plan and how many projects have been already released and taking place. The only thing that we wish that the momentum of releasing these kind of new projects takes a place in a more faster manner so that banks can participate and play a major role in financing these projects, whether for cash or non-cash facilities. Of course, Kuwait has endured severe challenges during its history, so what would you encourage investors to bear in mind when they look at the potential of this region as a whole in a wider context? I would like to let investors, of course, and I'm sure they have done, done their nitty-gritty study. You look at the GCC countries. It is countries that had a very strong cushion of oil. They have the wealth management. They have the capabilities. They have the liquidity. They have the people. They have infrastructure that varies from one country to the other. And some of them, of course, in these countries have given too much of liberalization for investors to come into the country and invest. Some other countries need to do more work on into that respect. But you look into these countries, you feel comfortable. You have a cushion behind you. You have the central bank support across the board. And they will help you when to come to invest into the country, even if we have the liquidity level. We need new investors' money to come into the country. The bank has just marked its 50th anniversary. So what would you see as its main priorities as it moves ahead? The bank has chosen to be a local bank for since the time even when the crisis started. And that's our mission. So concentration level would be on providing the best we can in terms of services, improving the existing product levels that we have, taking care of our customers on the lending side for the corporate and retail business activities. That's the main target that the bank is really looking for on the short and the medium term. And that's what we are looking for. We are not going to be outside as an international player. That's not our choice now. And we have chosen to be a local market player. Elham Mafus, thank you very much. You're most welcome.